There is a magical operation of maximum importance. The initiation of a new aeon. When it becomes necessary to utter a word, the whole planet must be bathed in blood. Andy? Yeah? I think I'm ready. Should we enter? I dare you to enter. That cat's always been here, right? No. <gasps> you know this door is tightly sealed. A new way out must be revealed. The plans you need, you'll find downstairs. By my ghost machine that needs repairs. Here we go. This will be what I assume the last time we play. <laughs> Here are the plans to fix my ghost machine. Where's the rhyme? Solve I spy riddles and play games to earn the missing parts. I want to play Doom. Okay, so these are the devices we need to build this infernal machine. I have a feeling it's going to be the precursor to Am. Let's get this shit out of the way. I assume this is the last time we're going to play I Spy Spooky Mansion, because I really don't see where we can go from building a goddamn ghost machine. I was not paying attention to what was the clue. It was chalk and what? It's chalk ice. I'm still standing. Uh, key, Can't. and where's a lock? Lock. Toothbrush, and... Toothpaste, top left. I you thought that was uh, super glue. Yeah, it looks more like rubber, or it looks like more like cement. Hammer, and golf ball, no. Tennis racket, and golf ball. <laughs> you fucking idiot. You're gonna doom us all. Well, see, I see a tennis racket, and I'm just supposed to think I'm supposed to hit the rock and roll express with it. The ghosts are gonna get out. Uh, but... Wow, she's really upping the ante. Nobody uses that kind yeah, of Yeah, that's not the right kind of paintbrush for, for watercolors there. Ooh. Win twice more, and I'll have a reward for you. But watch out. The objects match in a different way this time. Oh, God, she's given up completely on the rhyme scheme. Uh, one, eleven, two. Uh, top right. Top left. That's twelve. Spring. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Six, seven, eight, nine. I don't, I didn't, I guess we we're supposed to count the coils in the spring. Yeah. That seems kind of bullshit. A new record. Damn, she's excited. I think that starts with an I. Chris, can you spell I cup? I C U P. Oh, Chris, you're going to jail. I got goofed online. You're going to jail, Chris. That's also my email password. Andy's going to dox me. Uh, hand. H. Hand starts in H, Chris. H. H. Do you no, think my password is try nose. Paint. Leaf. Giraffe. Frog. Anchor Bay Entertainment. Chris, you're kicking the ass of this children's game. A mushroom. A mushroom. Here's your first ghost machine part. You'll need them all to make it start. 
Guys, we got propeller. Somebody meet me out. Does anyone have gas? Meet me at boat. You can keep playing mystery bins to find more matches. No, I think we're good. Andy, I died. I'm being replaced by Tommy Jarvis now. No. Oh but fuck. Three oh god, kill Jason. I'm Tommy a Jarvis. Cocoon, a pumpkin head. A horseshoe. Two shovels. A ball. A bee. A heart. A fish. And a bird in a tree. Hey, fuck you, Jason. Okay, so we gotta find a striped raccoon. Andy, quick, get me my peanut butter soda. That's the only way I know how to get raccoons out of their hiding place. I'm gonna have to go to like one of those novelty stores that sells like cat pee soda. Okay, fine. Then find me two Martian other raccoons vomit. and open up a local newspaper stand. No, I don't wanna. A striped raccoon. And life would be so much simpler for the scum of the earth boys if it wasn't for that raccoon. And then fireworks. Okay, horseshoe. See, we should be able to spot these out real quick. I can see it. Cause He's, where? It's right above you. Oh mouse. my god, you're right. A horseshoe. Well, there's a shovel outside, and then there's this a hand shovel inside. One. That's shovel. a spade. Yeah. Two shovels. But do you think like maybe she's already completed her ghost machine? And we're gonna just be collecting these parts as busy work. And then we find out like what the purpose of this infernal device is. We, we like plead with her, you can't turn it off. And she's like, do you mistake me for some kind of late 90s CD-ROM video game villain? I turned the ghost machine on 30 minutes ago. A ball. I'm having a ball with this game. Beware. A bee. It, it's it's on top of the let's say mummy? A ball. A fish. Drag the duck into a tree. <laughs> uh is it the swan? Up there. A bird in a tree. Oh, it lights up. She must have got that at Lowe's. Damn, shout outs to Lowe's. Great Lowe's reference. I've been waiting every episode of this game for this to finally pay off. A heart. I love you, frog. I'll miss I'll miss my friendship frog the most. Okay. And you were on fish duty. Oh, I am? Yeah. Pin one. One pin. Well, the second one's next to the. It's it's a bowling pin. It's outside. Outside. Go there. You go. Damn your Two use pins. of synonyms, you circuitous skeleton. That was alliteration, not not synonyms. You're using synonyms. Cin cinnamon. Here I am, my own cinnamon. Uh, uh, hold on. Up top. Is that supposed to be? A fish. It looks more like a dolphin, a which fish. is a mammal. Well, oh, it could be a shark. Yeah, I think it's a shark, actually. Hey, you need to learn the difference quick. That could save your life one day when you're stuck in a spooky mansion. Okay, where's Peter Pumpkinhead? Don't make a reference to that song. Andy, you're going to be sad when we beat this game because it'll be, it'll be goodbye to Peter Pumpkinhead. <laughs> a pumpkin head. Oh, why, oh, why, make you want to cry. I'm leaving. Okay, I need one more pin. Come on. You've trained your entire life for this moment. You need a pin? Is this Falls Count Anywhere? Clothes pin. I already clicked that one. No, 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 no. Next to the shoe, the horseshoe. Two pins. Oh, my God, you're right. You did it. We're one step closer to the Three ghost pins. machine. Hey, here's your fucking piece. Just take it. Great job. Oh, it's a pretzel. Here's machine part two. I'll put it down in the workshop for you. I don't know. Machine part two, not Trent's best album. 
I spy three snakes, a nail on the ground, a dime, a diamond, a frame that's round, a lantern, four letters, a cat, a queen, two holes for eyes, and the number 13. It's Taz! I found like every goddamn one of those while she was talking. Well then let's speed run this, come on. Cat, nail, queen. Uh, the jack has eyes cut out. A nail on the ground. A oh, cat. the lantern's next to the queen. A queen. A lantern. Ah! Some kind of deranged sex pervert. Two holes for Hey, eyes. sex pervert. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. F I R E. One letter. Two letters. Three letters. Where's that E at? It's on the thimble. I was really hoping that they'd sneak the word Four fuck letters. into this part of the game. Uh, the like, they, they didn't expect any of the kids to get this far in the game, or like they thought if their parents were watching them play, they would have been like, yeah, I get the gist of it. This is a fine family game. And you know, okay, spell out clitoris. Clitoris? Oh, that's not a round frame. Um, that's just a boom. Is a snake there? Is a snake there? A frame that's round. Uh, I don't see the third snake. One snake. Oh, there it is. Caterpillars, they're the snake Two of the snakes. insect kingdom. Well, that's centipede, but nice try. Shit. Um, it's on the moose head. Well, that's why it didn't work. If this was a caterpillar, it would have clicked. Three snakes. Oh my god, the diamond is the shape of the frame. A dime. Brilliant. Do you think that maybe, like, the Gotham City Trust... They gave Batman this big penny, and they felt, like, kind of awkward, so they gave Robin this tiny dime. I mean, it's bigger than a normal dime. You got you got to give it that. Click the goddamn diamond, Chris. Where is the damn, damn, damn dime? It's next to the dime. Oh, my. I was looking for an actual oh, diamond. It. This game tricked me. I'm sick of this tricky skeleton in this haunted mansion. Check my plans and you'll see where to put machine part three. Check my plans and you will see where the best place is you can lick me. Jesus Christ. The plans are just going to be a naked picture of her. Th she's a skeleton, she's naked. So it's just going to be a picture of her then. Or maybe it's sexier because she'll have clothes on. Like that's what, like what's attractive to skeletons. Oh, I get it? It's I Spy Spooky Mansion. No, it's not. Stop putting that in all the video titles. Yeah, I keep I keep putting I Spy with like the word I because I assume this game has a pun title and it doesn't. I've done it like 10 times. <laughs> Which is really weird because this is the fourth part. Well, you've also misspelled it on Twitter, so that probably evens out to 10. Wow, she's killed a lot of Muppets. That was a poodle. I just wasn't you quick fool. enough. I got foodled. Is that a mad alien? We get rewarded by showing that scene from that zombie movie. Nice collection. Where the person gets the Make big piece of wood stuck in their eye. I'll have a reward for you. Zebra? Dog? Okay, it's so just gonna be mammals. Beholders are mammals. It could be animals and maybe amphibians are included. Oh shit, you're right. Mammals have eyes. Sometimes mammals have bells. Oh, yeah, it's just animals. That earth's going to retroactively punish us. 
like we build the ghost machine and she's like, wait a minute, did you think it was animals? No, it was just supposed to be snakes! The mansion fucking rips in half. Well, considering the first one was a zebra, I highly doubt. A fucking... The tallest part of one of the spires of the tower cracks off and falls to the ground below, impaling Dracula. Oh, that's a different point-and-click game. Okay, so this time it's just fish. Fuck you, game. Oh, I took a fish away. I took my fish away and I'm gonna get a hit. I hate this game and what I've done with it. No! That's a frog. That's a fucking amphibian. Keep on frogging in the wee world. In the wee world? In the wee world. <laughs> it's late. It's like no, this is three the, in the morning. This is the PC version and the Wii version is different. Stop clicking frogs. Never. Go, froggy, go. Stop clicking this frog or you'll never beat this game. Go, froggy, go. You gotta keep on click. Oh. No, People I'm at home think this video is lame. There's that dude again. Oh man, we gotta do a game theory on this shit. Who that, like. I've seen that picture are. before. That's a famous picture I just. You saw that. That was I, that was a uh, fish when I clicked it. That was a piano. It. Shadow of the fish. Well done. Here's machine part four. You only need eleven more. Look, I'll just go to Home Depot. Just give me a shopping you list for God's sake. Playing to make more creepy collections. Yeah, but am I gonna get pieces to your infernal contraption? Your mean bean machine? Oh man, what if what if it was just the mean bean machine? I spy five ears, a yo-yo, a sun, an open mouth, the number one, a magnet, a match, six five-letter words, the longest green tail, and three little birds. No, not that green tail. Four little diamonds. Uh, there's an ear on the little book. The word doors is five letters. One ear. Another ear. The word games. Two Hold on, ears. I'm, I'm ear hunting. It's like I'm in the goddamn Vietnam War and I'm in Three platoon. Ears. Four ears. <laughs> Five ears. Hey, is that the picture of the guy you were talking about? Yeah. <laughs> He's the inventor right. of I Spy games. Uh, just a little bit down, there's games. One five letter word. Doors. Two I keep expecting we're going to play words. a Jackbox party game. This is one. This yeah, this is the weirdest part of the Jackbox party game because it's four hours long. Uh there's simple soups up there. You know what? We've been we've been supposed to be playing this with people in the Three, Twitch chat, but we're just not very words. popular. Also, we're not live streaming this. There's haunt. How to haunt. Four five letter words. Here's a fun fact. A yo-yo is like a noose for someone my size. And my suffering. A yo-yo. Don't even joke about that. The seventh ghost. Five. Five letter words. Study. The longest green tail. That's doing a real right. Six. Five letter words. Okay, if that little crocodile or whatever isn't the open mouth. Okay, open mouth. where are the other- oh, here's another bird. If- if we pan over and I click her and she flips us off and goes, here's the last bird, <laughs> this will get game of the year. Nope, you weren't brave enough to pull it off, I Spy Spooky Mansion. You're gutless and I don't respect you. I've gotta match my ass in your face. I've- I've made that in the first- that's a callback. That's not me being redundant, that's a callback joke. A match. I've gotta match. 
your embrace and my collapse. A son. You found my son. <laughs> I'm looking for my son, Nemo. Praise the sun. Oh, wait, hold on. No, she's a skeleton and we're praising the sun. She's going to pull out like a scimitar and come at us. Quick, okay, if we just stand on this ledge, she'll roll at us, we step out of the way, easy experience points. Okay. What's an experience point? Uh, I think you mean a soul. Ooh. I'm sorry, you're Ooh. right. Ooh. We get it's the not keys dark to experience a, points. We get the keys to a <laughs> Kia soul. The number one. Oh, on first. The trophy. He was number one. The number one. Here, the chart have a trophy. Part number five. You're on your way. And doing quite well, I have to say. Thank you. Where this character was going to call us gay. And we'd have to write an article about <laughs> the problematic skeleton. I'm going to work at Polygon. First I article is about the you. problematic skeleton in Ice Spy Spooky a Mansion. A ghostly face. A snake. I'd expect a this kind of attitude from Duke Nukem, question. but not you, skeleton. Two moons, a star, four arrows, eyeglasses, and ink in a jar. Well, the glasses are next to get out. Out. A face. See, that's oh, ghostly face. That skeleton's not homophobic. They're reading Out magazine. No, she's writing the words get out. She's going to put it on a gay couple's apartment get, door. Get out magazine. She's selling subscriptions. Uh, there's a, are those eyeglasses or goggles? And he just, he just can't get over the fact the skeleton's his problematic fave. Eyeglasses. Well, birds are like the plane of the animal kingdom. <laughs> yeah, click it. Let's see. You remember, you probably, you're Ooh. probably not clicking hard enough. Go back. A ghostly face. Nah, that's not a ghost sheet. That's her clan hood because she's also a racist. She's a racist homophobic skeleton in a haunted house. You know how clan hoods all have that big scary mouth on them? <laughs> yes. Ooh. Ooh. Ink in a jar. There's one arrow. A star. Finally, we can beat Ganondorf. One. Oh arrow. God, she is problematic. She mains Hanzo. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh. I was fine with the homophobia and the racism, Two but no, arrows. I'm out. Hanzo main. Do you even care about party comp? Party comp. Yeah, party comp. Party comp. What what's so wrong about saying party comp? Party comp. <laughs> party comp. Boba Fett. A snake. Ah, uh, good it's a great Webel stuff reference there. It's a little bit dated, but whatever. My headphones won't stay on my head. I found two arrows. Oh, first and second floor. Three arrows. Oh, of course, There's Eros, the god of sex. There's a moon up there, too. Four arrows. Or as Marilyn Manson would put it, the god of fuck. There's no One moon. There's a moon outside, too. <gasps> That's no moon. Uh. Oh, yep, wait, it is a moon. I'm sorry. I sure hope not. If so, our fucking Two tides are moons. wrecked. Our tides are shrecked. Is this video funny yet? I mentioned Shrek. Are you here? It's got a question mark. I still think that's the most foreboding thing I've mark. ever seen. I'm going to fucking put that on a post-it note and just put it all over the place. She's been a little lazy today. She hasn't trick scared or haunted anybody. 
You're going to turn around. It's going to say, none of this needed, baby dead. A chimbley. They're all this fucking drawing. A chimney. We're going to, is there a paper plane? Of course, there, yep. Some, 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 murdered. Some, 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 let go. I want to do it. Solve this puzzle. Chains on the light. A chain. Come and ride the chain. Ride the chain. One more done. You must be smart. Here's your sixth ghost machine part. And deep down inside, you have a rock and roll heart. I spy a red rose, a moon that's white, a fingerprint, a fish, a fright, the eye of a needle, the tongue of a snake, three eighths in a row, and a paper snowflake. Okay, paper snowflake. Red roses on Rose Garden. I beg your pardon. Rose Red Garden. Rose. Red Rose at night. Sailor take fright. <laughs> okay, where's that fright? Cause she she said it weird, so it's probably written. Fright. Three eighths in a row. Do you think the game's just gonna fuck us by like not having one of the items on here? It's like Gauntlet, you can never actually beat it. Yes. This isn't the I Spy Spooky Mansion, this is the Hotel California. <laughs> Cause you can never leave. Oak tree, rose garden, driveway, swamp, iron gate, front door, fountain, back porch, graveyard. That was a coincidence. Right. Yeah, I never would have found that. Yeah. This game's too. This game's elite too hard. Gamer. People, we might not beat this one. It's too hard. You're making Dark Souls joke. This game is harder than Dark Souls. This is the Dark Souls of puzzle games. This is the Dark because Souls it's of hard. video games. This is the Crash Bandicoot of Dark Souls. I'm supposed to hit all the crates? No way. It'd be a lot funnier if I knew where the fucking snowflake was. You think the word snowflake is written? Because we can just go on Twitter and say that we disagree uh, with something President Trump did, and then we'll we'll have a bunch of the word snowflakes appear on the screen. This video now has an expiration date. Oh, the fish is next to is on swamp. A fish. A fish. A fish. Oh my god, one of the antennas is a needle. She's playing for fucking keeps now. The eye of a needle. It might be too a late fish. for me to be playing this game. It wasn't even on the butterfly, it was a in the wood snowflake. grain. A butterfly. She's gonna have us looking for actual pixels now. It's gonna be like Thimbleweed Park. Is the snake on swamp? People at home are pulling out their goddamn hair. Maybe I keep telling you, we need to buy that goddamn Blade Runner machine. Quarter to five. Over two. Enhance. 
For okay. some reason, I have a feeling it's in graveyard. Like, you know, there's all those things of grass at the bottom. Maybe there's a snake. Maybe not. Yeah, I don't see a moon. I don't see a snake. We also need a fingerprint. It turns out this entire game is like an elaborate ruse for us to put our fingerprint on like a murder weapon. Like we'll get so frustrated and go, fine, I'll put my own fucking fingerprint and then I'll find that. Wait a minute. This isn't a box of butterflies. This is a handle of a gun. I'm sorry, guys, but I have two priors. I hope they throw your ass in the fryer. Oh, fingerprint. Where? Left. No, you keep oh, passing No, it. I know, but I'm like trying to show the audience. Can you believe that shit? Can you believe that shit? Lady, this game was meant for A children. Oh, boy. Oh, oh. snake, snake. Where? On, on the driveway. Oh, my God. Kids, get out of the there. The tongue of a snake. The tongue. No, oh, I'm going to have so much fun sentence mixing the word tongue. The tongue. You say like a Dragon Ball character. The tongue. The tongue. Okay. Oh, is the moon on graveyard? Maybe. Oh, that's You're right. No, that's a moon with a white outline, a moon. not a moon that's that white. is white. Come on, now you're just cheating. She cheat, cheat, cheated. Part number seven. You're doing quite well. You'll be making ghosts soon. I can tell. Oh, oh, oh wait, what? The ghost machine. So it's not like it's going to let us talk it's to ghosts. It's a gun, Chris. It's a bomb. It's going to make a bunch of ghosts. She, we're building the atom bomb. This is the Manhattan Project. It takes place entirely in the spooky mansion. I, I am becoming death, horses. devourer of what worlds. A mirror, a brush, a bat, white toes, a cat's tail, a green vest, four red shoes, the biggest ears, and two twos. Okay, there's two red shoes, then there's two up there, and then Garrison One Keeler has two, shoe. and so does Elvis Costello. So Garrison Keeler. Two oh. red shoes. Where's Hello. Garrison Keeler? He's in. He's Tingle. Oh. Someone said that's a Pinocchio. No, that, that's, no that's, that's the Pinocchio, Pinocchio doll. Three red shoes. That's Eugene Merman. That's Garrison Keeler. This is how he's spending his retirement. It's in a spooky Four mansion. Red shoes. We now take you to beautiful Lake Wobegon, where a mandolin player is shitting all over my legacy. How do we know this isn't where he stayed in Lake Wobegon? We'll need you to find some loot fisk. A cat's tail. I don't know why that was funny. I hope... That our, our target age demographic for this is like people in their 50s and 60s. Because otherwise they're not going to get all these great prairie home companion jokes. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also check out our sponsors, audible.com, Squarespace, Build It, You Should, and of course, ketchup. Yes, nothing goes better on a burger than ketchup. And of course, powder milk biscuits. The, the delicious Flaky powder milk biscuits. And then we have um Andy, go get your, your lap guitar for this next bit. Has anyone ever talked about the fact that Guy Noir's name is Black Guy? That kind of bothers me. One horse. Two horses. I'm sorry the concept of black guys bother you, Andy. Maybe you were made for this racist skeleton. Jesus. <laughs> Who was also a black guy. Three horses. She kind of sound angry about that. Three horses. By the way, the Three horses? 
I'm to overthrow the Earl of Dunkirk and you've brought me three horses? And this elephant. Oh. A green vest. Nope, she took it away. Just when just when we thought we had the answer, she changes the questions. Uh, the red guy with the ears. He's got a button nose. Whoa. A button nose. They say video games aren't scary anymore. A bat. Hey, is that that little kid in the bib? That looks like a, a meme mirror. picture. I feel like I've seen it before. What little kid in the bib? In the frame, top left. Yeah, yeah, that's a meme. Well, that's, if it wasn't that's before, hung, it is that's now. Hungry Boy. I'm hungry. Like boy. in impact font, it'll be like, I'll have one hamburger. And then underneath it, it was like, and every fucking fry in the place. Oh, there's a two there, by the way. One, two. I don't know how to make memes, folks. I'm an old I, man. I knew you'd find it if I just tricked you into making a meme. You do a hungry boy, then. I'm hungry and, okay, for what's it pussy. <laughs> it's, okay, no, it's a different meme. It just says, this is my pussy-eating bib. And that's the whole meme. There's nothing... Can somebody Photoshop shrimp and ain't easy onto that boy's bib? Shrimp and white wine. He looks like he's part of that whole McElroy family. Yeah, he looks like he's a McElroy. No, I was going to say he looks like a uh, geez, Billy. Why does your mom let you have two weenies? A cat's tail. Yeah, he does. Uh, Where's the other two? Are the white toes her toes? White toes. Oh, she's ticklish. I'm aware. <laughs> you have been married to her for years. Oh, it's on that little, the, the red. Yeah. You can say it, Andy. The Chinese boy. I didn't know that was a boy. Jesus Christ, you're racist, homophobic, misogynistic. You're just full of surprises, but in a good way. Okay, where's the brush? I don't know. I'm afraid of being accused of anything. <laughs> <laughs> if I speak, I lose. This is how Chris bullies me into silence. And also it's next to the little Chinese boy. Doll. You it's racist! Not, it's not actually a, it's not actually a living person. That's actually emo Phillips. Oh boy is my face red. Another one finished. Here's part number eight. Are you ready to make ghosts? I can't wait. I thought Shannon didn't play with dolls. The puzzle's almost done, so quit your fussin' and just remember, no Russian. <laughs> That's the ghost machine. Are we done in the room? Well, we didn't- I spy a bear, two ducks, a snail, a vase with three flowers, a spotted tail, a pair of scissors, a pair of flies, a bottle half full, and yellow eyes. By the way, if I seem to be really hard on Andy with all the accusatory statements, it's just me kind of paying him back. I feel like that's how most of our Let's Plays, live streams, conversations, our entire life is gone. And just like in Battlefield, sometimes it's fun to snipe your allies. You're going to get banned. Two I'm gonna, I got it on video. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> One duck. Uh, pair of eyes up there, pair of flies down there. But any two ducks having sex. Two ducks having sex. Two ducks. There's a snail, there's the eyes, there's the flies. A snail. There's the snails, there's the flies. A pair of flies. Give me the eyes. Look out, world, here comes the eyes. Yellow eyes. 
Okay, a bottle half full. I've been drinking perfume, full. getting fucking wrecked on potpourri in here. Why'd you say it like a that? A pair of scissors. Let's get syrupy. <laughs> oh my god. I was gonna joke about this, but she totally made me do it. A vase with three flowers. She's That's like getting that, tricksy. That's like that Dracula's Legacy game. Dracula's Legacy is I Spy Spooky Mansion. It should be. Uh, is tail. the spotted tail the fish? You're correct. A spotted tail. Blah! You've destroyed my puzzles! I knew I should have filled this castle with monsters! Here's the next part. Number nine. It goes somewhere on that machine of mine. See, I've been wanting to watch the Castlevania series on Netflix, but I assume it's just this. <laughs> watch it quick! Before Netflix goes away forever. I spy eight stars, a turtle, a train, a hand that's red, a moon on a chain, three closed eyes, a crayon, a crown, a heart, and a letter turned upside down. Oh, is it the T? Because I thought it was going to be the N. A letter or the I. upside down. Is Netflix like in financial problems right now? Yep. Oh, man. See, I thought, like, you meant watch it quick before they lose the rights to it like they do all the time. Like, which is why I can't watch Red Dwarf on Netflix or The Deer Hunter or Apocalypse Now or The Abyss or almost any movie I can think of Netflix no longer streams. And then it's like, but guys, didn't we make Castlevania? How did we lose yeah. the rights to something we made? We're really bad at business. Also, we should have never worked with Konami. All they do is yell at us. Oh my god, the second they work with Konami, they they get $20 million in debt. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, get Jim Sterling in here. Three closed eyes. Two on the moon, one on the rat. Or mouse. Oh my god, that's creepy. One closed eye. Tell Montenegro, they stack on top of each other. Two closed eyes. Stack them to the heavens! In the slipper. Hey, you mind not poke him in the eye? I'm trying to fucking sleep. Three closed eyes. We left that light on the entire time, just torturing the small animal. Maybe he's scared and he needs the light. Okay, we He's found afraid a of monsters. We found a crayon. Now we need to find a crown. For for probably like up until I was probably almost in middle school, I called crayons crowns. Uh, is it on the card? Is that a king? You're right. A crown. The heart is also on the cards because you don't have the heart of the cards, said Okaiba. Oh, it's on the lollipop. A moon on a chain. A heart. Okay, we need to find a red hand. That's ominous. Yeah. Red line of pain. Looks like you've been caught red-handed. Good thing I have your fingerprints. No Russian. <laughs> I, I gotta admit, this entire time I've been playing the fingerprints scene from uh, Animaniacs in my head. This entire time I've been thinking of Nick Cave and the Bad Seeds with his red right hand. <laughs> One star. That's my review for this game. Good night, everyone. Two stars. Three stars. Four stars. Five stars. 
We can make her into like a movie reviewer really easily. Like sentence mixer saying, get out gets five stars. Six stars. Oh, do you think we can get her to say Scott Steiner? <laughs> because then we can say Scott Steiner gets minus five stars. Um, okay, there's one on the doily and there's one up left. We're up left. Seven there. stars. Oh, did you have she got excited when she said seven stars because she Eight thought we were playing stars. Super Mario RPG. Oh, the train. It's on the sock. A train. Turtle. The turtle could not save us. The turtle's in the turtle club. A turtle. Am I turtly enough to get in the turtle club? Let's all remember 9-11. <laughs> God. Never forget about the turtle club. Turtle, turtle. Will. Oh my, you dizzy bitch. A hand that's red. This game is too I will smart never for us, forgive guys. you. I will never forgive you for that. You have made an enemy this day. By now you know my little scheme. Here's the tenth part of the ghost machine. It's probably not a good idea to let us know that this is a scheme. Or to use a half rhyme like that. Okay, we've done all this shit, right? Yeah. Okay, what is left? Uh, the ceiling or the attic? You're right. Oh, this is gonna be the hardest one because it's like. Buy a belt, a blue Never mind, it's gonna be easy. Tie, two letter B's, one red eye, four wheels, a whale, a pencil, a three, a wooden pin, and a metal key. A belt. Oh, blue bow tie. It's on the little. It's on Jeffrey. A blue bow tie. You're styling and profiling, Jeffrey. Please don't kill me and my family. Stop profiling, Jeffrey. Who's the real racist, Jeffrey? Were you say, were you asking him or were you saying Ooh, who's the real yes. racist, Jeffrey? <laughs> like pleasantly. Hey guys, you know that Jeffrey's racist? Three wheels. Find me a book, a penny, a math test, a shoe, a key, a real racist. A metal key. That's not a real rhyme, but I mean, half these aren't, so fuck it. You having problems at home, Andy? You're yes. being really critical of your skeleton One wife. Red eye. Oh man, that could be the, the follow-up to Momus' dear wife, skeleton wife. Chris, what the fuck do you mean am I having problems at home? My wife keeps locking me in and then kicking me out. She just wants to spend time with you. And also without me. <laughs> she needs her space. You're not spending enough time with me and also too much. Uh, there's a SB on the... The... Yeah. Look, she's just a woman who knows what she wants. You're not spending enough time with me. In three, two, one. That's enough time with me. Oh, on the chair, there's Boo to the right. Not anymore. Two letter Bs. It's been Chronos and it's been Chronos and Classic Infundibulumed. I'm gonna leave the fuck up in because that's a very hard <laughs> phrase to say. A whale. We're in Skip's museum, by the way. That cat. That's not a shadow of a cat. That, that cat's phasing in because its particles are spread through space and time. It's a shadow cat. You should read the book, The Sirens of Titan. That's where these jokes are, like, conveying to you. It's a good book, Andy. We need one more wheel. I'll oh, wait. I actually did buy you a copy of that recently. Yeah, I'll read I? it. Yeah, it's a good book. I just, I, I write in my bed, so I don't have a lot of time to read. I usually, I usually read before I go to bed. Are you Garth Marenghi? Yes. I feel bad because I'm stealing that joke from Giant Bomb, but it also applies to you that you write more than you read. Okay, where's that wheel? Surely it's not the little spindle on the ground to right, left, up, right. Just a little bit, a little more. It's not that, is it? Yeah, it is. Ah. <sighs> 
four wheels. And he writes in bed, and then he reads himself. what he writes. Which is why the word cool tapes is written above his bed. I need you to find a bag of four grapes. It's not, is that not the wooden pin? I guess it's not. Ooh, buddy, where's that wooden pin? I don't know. You're zooming around real fast. Hard to... Four wheels. Okay, I'm going to go slow and you yell when you see a wooden pin. There it is. Oh, it's a safety pin again. God. That's a uh, safety pin. It's a clothes pin. Clothes pin. Shit. What kind of pin have you seen that's wooden that's not a clothes pin? You know what? I've been putting... I, I thought I was being <gasps> punk rock. A three. I've been using clothes pins in my nose and ears. A three. So I guess that's why I don't have any friends, because not only... Do the other 1980s style punk rockers know that I'm a poser? They also assume that I think they smell. Hey guys, it's me. I'm punk rock. We're gonna I have a TV party tonight. You're an ace. Have you put the machine parts in place? Look out, honey, because I'm using technology. There's a pen. Oh, we need to do the one in the kitchen. I spy two spiders. A red K, a three, a shadowy X, an upside down key. Whoa, three a shadowy X? X? A plane, an acorn. Man, you better keep an eye on your woman, two keys dude. On a chain and a key Someone from her past is rolling back in the town. A shadowy X. I keep telling him to leave me alone, that I've moved on. But he's always like, you up? A shadowy X. Oh, never mind. It was that. It was it was an actual shadow X. There's a spider and there's one on the lock. One spider. Three hearts. Three motherfucking hearts. <laughs> spiders. The K is on top, on the king. King with a K. K, 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 K. A red K. The three is on that fancy lady. A three. A key back in place. Oh, upside down key is next to the K. Two keys on a chain. They're all keys. Just click all the goddamn keys and I'll give you the piece. Get out of my house. Oh, do you see the corn? There's a corn. Hey, it's a corn. An acorn. And corn. The ace is the left. Wait, Andy, are you the shadowy ex? An ace. What do you mean? Have you been lying this whole time and you guys are actually divorced and you're just too ashamed to admit it? That's why she keeps ghosting you, both proverbially and literally. Is Look, if you need to talk about it, we can talk about it. Here, let's talk about it after you click that plane that's on the postcard. One heart. A plane. There's the king of hearts. Two hearts. Two motherfucking hearts. If her hands just reaches forward and she's holding like a disgustingly viscera covered realistic depiction of a human heart, I will give this game five stars. Where that last hat, uh, heart hat, where that last hat be at? Where's that last heart be at? Come on. Oh, it's in the spider web. Not that one. Ah, I see. Spider's trying to pick you up on the rebound. Three hearts. Charlotte's gonna write some ass. Some ass. 
one plus one plus one is three. One plus two plus two plus one. More parts you'll get. One plus one plus two plus one. I had to stop her from screaming. Are you saying I'm having an affair with Charlotte from Charlotte's Web? No, I'm saying she divorced you and it's time for you to move on with the help of Charlotte from Charlotte's Web. But Chris, affair is a smorgasbord. Two nuts, a, a shell, pussy. A cobwebby name, a flower, a bell, a seven in place, a carved violin, a twelve for midnight, time, and a pin. For some reason, I don't think Paul Lind is probably the best expert to be giving us advice on women. Two nuts. Oh, this is where the game becomes great. These nuts. It's One a nut. nut. Two nuts. Cobwebby name is obviously Plum Pump. Again, it's hard to a see. Name. She is. She is hitting on you, Andy. The next, the ne tomorrow you're going to wake up and it's going to say nice legs. Daisy Dukes. <laughs> day, the next day, Daisy Dukes. It takes a really long time to make those webs. Uh, the 12 is midnight. A 12 for midnight. Put the seven in its place. Time. Seven, you think you're so big, but guess what? There's literally an infinite amount of numbers that are bigger and better than you. So why don't you take your bad attitude and get the fuck out of here? A seven in place. Those are pins. We found like a pin in almost every... Are we constructing Pinhead? Are we constructing Pinhead yes. like he's a fucking Build-A-Figure? Pinhead, like, you know how he has clothes pins and safety pins? He's in the punk rock. And a bowling pin. He's in the punk rock. A hammer. Say, uh. I've got something to say. I killed your baby today. Oh, that sounds like Steve Urkel <laughs> coming in. Laura, you got any cheese? <laughs> Doesn't matter much to me as long as there's cheese. <laughs> Doesn't matter much to me as long as the cheese. Uh, is it a push pin? A pin? What rhymes with Carl? Violin's up there. All I can think of is Jarl, which if the song was about uh, Skyrim, it would a work. carved violin. I am the Jarl Carl. Sweet, lovely Carl, I'm waiting for your... Barl. Flower. Thrall. Um. A shell. Stop. Sorry. It's gonna be picked up by the mics. A bell. Andy keeps getting mad at me because I tap my finger, but that's my puzzle solving finger. Aren't you clever? Here's part 13. Only two more missing from the ghost machine. Okay, just as long as we're not putting together Tin Machine. Because let's, let's face it, David Bowie was the only thing making that group interesting, and I don't think he's coming back. Especially not for I Spy Spooky Mansion. He might still show up in Twin Peaks, though. Don't, don't count that out. <laughs> I spy three coins, a sailing ship, a heart, a horse, a paper clip, an open mouth, an S, a needle, a fly in a cup, and a spotted beetle. Nope, oh, looks like Ringo's got the syphilis. An open mouth. Oh. Oh. If you have that one mental disorder, you can't stop seeing faces and objects. 
This game is hell for people like that. Is that really a disorder? Yeah, there's a there's a, a mental disorder where like literally every object you see, you see a face in it. Oh, also okay. every object. I have I have that disorder too. Every time I see a beetle, I think it's a Razor Ramon. He looks that. like he's he looks like he's wearing Scott Hall's jacket, doesn't he? Like his little vest when he was in the Outsiders. No, um, there's an S to the left on the napkin. <laughs> An S. Find me horse. Is the fly on the eye in the cup? Yep. A fly in a cup. A sailing ship. One coin. Two coins. Three coins. A spotted beetle. A needle. A paper clip. Oh, the heart's on the spoon. That's Pinhead's secret shame, is that one of his pins is a paper clip. Yeah, it's it's the guy from from the first Daredevil movie. A heart. We have such sights to show you. Your suffering will be legendary. Even in he Is that a paperclip? Shut up. Stop picking on me. Golden horse, golden horse. Oh, I could, I could go for some golden horse right now. I don't really care for their potatoes, but it's a pretty good horse. You know, you know whose mashed potatoes I really like? The Pony Express. Regional jokes about chicken stores. Have you ever met a ghost before? You will soon just finish one more. I hope it's Patrick Swayze. I spy three cups, a cat that's gold, an empty bottle, an apple. Mold. The first bug in line. Blue snail spice. A candle, a snake, and bug twice. That's that's a good reminder. We're actually brought to you by Blue Snail Spice. Blue Snail Spice. Uh for you know, I get home, it's been a long day. I don't have the time to go to the store, and I'm like, man, I can go for some snails. Well, they ship it directly to your door. Just use the coupon Scum of the Earth to get 20% off your next order. That's way too long of a coupon. Uh, okay, bug on bug spice. Blue snail spice under spice. A bug cat remover. That's gold. Bug once. Blue snail spice. Uh. Big Island Pineapple. And the word bug, or the word mold. Bug twice. Bug. Mold. I feel like I'm always looking for snakes. A snake. Apples up top left. An apple. I don't think that's a worm sound unless that worm is opening a rift between time and space. Jesus. The first bug in line. Oh, he's getting a Nintendo Switch. Uh, the bug's on the, the stove thing. Come again? On the, the pipe, the stove pipe. Ah. The first bug in line. Not anymore, he dead. An empty bottle. See, I thought it was gonna be one of those tricky puzzle again where we were gonna have to eat this hot dog and drink all of the hot dog water to make this an empty bottle. No, it's it's fucking what is it, Kobayashi? Oh yeah, that's he his dips technique. his hot dog into a, a water a, a a jar of water 
and then he'll Store save it. it for months. Yeah, in a haunted mansion. Yeah, where he lives. Are the cups just teacups? One cup. And then the frog cup. Two cups. Find me that candle cups. and we are home free. All three of the battle toads are in that cup. No. As the candle in the bone basket. Morpheus drinking a 40 in the death basket. A candle. Bah. I see two frogs fucking in a cup. The final part. Here's number 15. You just now took that from the study. Start the ghost machine. Okay, I'm nervous, but we're doing it. We're starting the ghost machine. And then we can start our fourth playthrough. Follow the plans to put the parts in place. Well, I wonder where the seven's gonna go. If you fuck this up, I'll mess up your face. I'll mess up your face. Well, the S and the seven. Yeah, pretty obvious. Wait. Does this just salt and pepper ghosts? Yeah. The ghost of salt and pepper. No, you're thinking of the chick from TLC. She's the one that's dead. I feel like playing Machinarium for some reason. <laughs> The funnel goes under the bottle that doesn't have a funnel. Oh, it goes on the Orby thing to the left, I think. Left, left, left. Ah. Hot rats. Let's do it. Let's make a ghost. Ah, the ghost machine is fixed. Now you can use it to make some very spooky ghosts. Start by clicking button number one. Oh man. Can you Photoshop the face from Awaken My Love, the Childish Gambino album, into that, the blue spirally thing? That's well, what I'm, it looks like. I'm scared of the ghosts we're gonna, like... It could be one of our grandparents, but there's equal chance it could be like Attila the Hun or like Vercingetorix or Caligula. Shadow. To make this go. Or Shadow the Hedgehog. You Fuck it, sure. These jars He's got a gun! To make this ghost. You have to fill these jars by finding ingredients that I've hidden around the house. Oh no. Here's a clue for the first ingredient you have to find. Are you first find a bat? Go to the front. Fucking hall. kidding me? It's a shadow that's cast up. Oh, these ones aren't on the puzzle. Wall. These are the ones that are just hidden regularly. First find right a there. bat. One bat. Oh my god, now, this is when you find out the final dungeon has been the overworld all ghost, along. Then you'll be ready to make this ghost. This rules. One flashlight. To see the ghost called Shadow fly to and fro, just return to the workshop. And then do what? Crash box. No. Uh, uh. You didn't fucking tell me there were going to be jump scares. You made one ghost. You'll need to make all seven to get out of the house. Graveyard. A broken bone is the first item to find. Give me your arm, Andy. Curtains 
are what it is hiding behind. I already remember exactly where the broken bone is, so please don't break my bones. Oh, click the curtains. Right there. One broken bone. In a gravestone-shaped cushion is stitched R.I.P. Go find it now. It's easy to see. Oh, what? Ryan Reynolds, where's my cushion? There it is. One R.I.P. Now grab a lantern. It hangs from a hook. Next to the fire is where you should look. Do you see it? Because I do. One lantern. Go make the graveyard ghost if you dare. This one is sure to give you a scare. I'm really hoping against hope it's just a giant monster truck. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday! Grave digger. I should have known it was you by the grave digger monster truck parked outside. That's very sad. Yeah, that's really scary to know that even when you're dead, you still feel pain. Tick tock. An hourglass teeters on the arm of a chair. Go find it now at the top of the stairs. Get to the top of the move Get to, to the, the top, top of the stairs. stairs. One hourglass. An alarm clock is the next thing you need. It rests on a shelf in a place where you read. Well, we haven't found the bathroom in this game yet. Oh, it's up there. One alarm clock. We should know by the You'll fact they're like Scooby-Doo colored. Like they obviously don't match the, the background image. With the seventh ghost book. The funny thing is I think they do because I think they just took the pictures from the books and like edited them. One twelve. You found all the items. So here's your last rhyme. Go back to the workshop. It's TikTok time. <laughs> I have a feeling she has a large sledgehammer that just has the words TikTok written on it. She's gonna kill one of us. Hey kids, it's TikTok time. Who wants to be the first to be turned into a ghost? You are the TikTok of Big Ben's cock. Oh, he's a pervert ghost. Or like a shoplifter. Or a shoplifter that's a pervert because he just steals dildos. Or a whistler. There's nothing wrong with stealing the dildos. Well, stealing. You remember in, in uh, Les Miserables when Jafar arrests that guy for stealing a dildo? I can't believe Jafar stole a dildo in this great play. I did not say Jafar. Damn it, I just said Jafar and now Chris can sentence mix it. Remember? I'm Jaff Far. Remember in Les Mis when that dude steals a loaf of bread to feed his family and so they imprison him in a lamp in the Cave of Wonders for all time? That was a little, it's a little much. You remember when he stuffs that loaf of bread up his asshole? Two crooked nails. A spring is next on your list, so go look. It rests on the floor, right next to a book. A spring is next to this ago. Look, it rests on the floor, right next to a book. There it is. 
sun spring. Go find an oil can. It has a oil long can. spout. If you look by the fireplace, you'll find it, no doubt. Sorry, I'm not home right now. I'm burning down my house because I'm leaving antique oil cans next to a lit fireplace. Leave a message. Why I won't call you back cats. because I'm burning to death. Now find two gears. You've got plenty of time. Look where 12 numbers appear with a rhyme. It's, 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 I think it's in that room. Side room. So we need Marcus and Dom. Oh, spider web. Two gears. Go back to the workshop. I hope this ghost doesn't give us a rusty venture, or even worse, a double frogman. Oh no, robots have souls! You Australians turn the cast of Team Fortress 2 into robots for nothing! Robots have souls, you fools! Now I'm, I'm super bummed about those Transformers movies. Meow. First, go find a wind-up mouse. It's near a tall clock in this spooky house. Okay, well, first off, it's canonical that the Transformers have souls. That's true. I'm sorry. That was, that was insensitive of me. One wind-up mouse. Buy the stove on a wooden shelf. Find a piece of cheese and help yourself. I want to say in the comic books, doesn't Starscream like just become a soul at one point? Well, I mean, yeah, they have to have souls because Optimus Prime comes back from the dead. I want to say when they die, their souls actually go into the matrix of leadership and like they're incorporeal at that time. But yeah, I believe that that Megatron is haunted by Starscream's ghost at one point. I think he's just like pink energy or something. I can't remember. Oh, that would suck if Energon was just the soul of Transformers. And that's what they were really fighting over all this time. One the fucking Decepticons are necromancers. Find cat eyes in the upstairs hall. They're in a picture on the wall. I'm sorry. Did you just say that having like necromancers would suck and like... Are implying that Two that wouldn't be the most badass eyes. shit in the world. Necromancy. Of yarn is next, robots. Room with red walls. It's resting now on a shelf full of dolls. One ball of yarn. You found all the things for the ghost called Meow to make it. Go to the workshop right now. I was really hoping she was going to say right meow. Excuse me, did you say meow? Do I look like a cat to you? Do you see me going nimbly bimbly from tree to tree? All right, pets have souls. Uh, no. Suck it, Catholic Church. I think the thing we need to focus on is that robotic wind-up toys of mice have souls. Pets have souls. Robots have souls. Wind-up toys. Robot have pets have souls. Yeah. Critter. Oh no, it's gonna be the ghost of Billy Zane. On top of a book, it's somewhere in the library. So go look. <laughs> Take a look, it's in a book, this disgusting eyeball got ripped out of a dude's face. Yep. What? He's just hanging out. Oh, hey, he is. Hey, what's up? Rusty? 
gonna take this one eyeball. freshly plucked eyeball and Find put it in my pocket. Yeah, I don't need it. It's cool. Red. Look for a snake sneaking out from under a bed. Look, I'm just taking some time for myself. I just now realize that I'm dead. The blue tunnel of the afterlife is opening up, and my father's ghost, who was also a robot, is beckoning to me. But I just feel like there's some things I need to process. I don't want to pry too much, but do you mean adopted father? Because I don't know how fatherhood works with robots. One hey, it's Meow. Well, the singularity happened, Andy. Robots are making robots now. What room are they in? We should have listened to Stop Elon Musk think. instead of making fun of his weird teeth. It's it's like that movie Robots with Robin Williams. Just like how Les, Les Mis has Robin Williams. And Two like, flies. there's that scene where Go to the they're talking about delivering the baby. Wide. There's a big furry and then spider hiding inside. The mom's like, oh, it's okay, you missed the delivery, but we can still fuck. I think that's what she says in the movie. I think that's the joke. Man, this joke would be funnier if 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 anyone in the world remembered the film Robots. Yeah. Or if we weren't still mourning the death of Robin Williams. Yeah, that, that would also Put that clip of, of Robin Williams saying Neon Genesis what Evangelion in the video spider. somewhere. Hop to the window. Do you think we're gonna find Robin Williams' floor. ghost? Find a frog sitting under a four. They put Robin Williams' ghost into one of the Eva units. So this is this is probably from a few episodes ago, but remember we made a joke about the frog in the four. You found my frog. frog. Making the ghost is the last thing to do, but beware, Gritter is likely to frighten you. Okay, this game is really setting up a spooky atmosphere. I appreciate that in a horror game like this. It's not just jump scares. It's like. Critter sounds like he'd be one of our hillbilly friends. Skater, critter. Rusty. What was the one from Hey Arnold? <laughs> okay, I've been making Vonnegut jokes this entire time, but a goddamn Trafalmadorian just showed up. Made the first six okay, here ghosts. we go. Are you ready for ghost number seven? There's a book on the on the shelf, the seventh ghost. Get out. To make ghost number seven, find the six that you know. First go to my secret room and look for Shadow. Shadow! That's right, Sonic. It's me, Shadow. Remember. No Russian. Wait a minute. I said there's the little coil thing from Awaken My Love, which has the title, or the, not the title, Shadow. but the first song Look in the movie the Get Out. Into the night. Graveyard is lurking in Moonlight also came out in 2017. And so did a movie called Graveyard that I just made up. Well, we have to film it right now. The Oscar was actually supposed to go graveyard. to Graveyard. Graveyard. Hurry up. Don't be late for TikTok. You'll face him on the biggest clock. Kesha's still alive. Oh, maybe it's Kesha with a dollar sign. All right, TikTok clock. It's my favorite Mario level. Well, that was a quick level. Tick. Talk. Find a bell on a book, and you'll find Rusty, too. Look upstairs. He's waiting for you. We established that when we ran into him earlier. Is the seventh ghost going to eat all the other ghosts? He's a composite ghost. Like that episode of Danny Phantom. This searching is tough. 
Are you tired now? Go take a nap and you'll find Meow. I'm, I'm actually, yeah, pretty tired. It's like four in the goddamn morning now. And we're on like episode five of this goddamn let's play of a game for children that start off as an April Fool's prank. For you, maybe. Meow. Also, is it the cool that we're gonna finish this game, but we're never gonna finish Deadly Premonition? Into an empty pot. Oh, there's no clue. Uh, probably the kitchen. Oh, yeah. Pot. Pots and kitchens. I thought a garden. I was like, but there's not a garden. <laughs> Critter. What's the last thing you need to set Get Out free? Go back to the workshop and look for me. Will do. Oh, it's going to turn out the skeleton's been Phantom Ganon the whole time. You fool! Now my true form can it's be time revealed! At last to get outside. Get out will take you for a ride. Oh, so this is a sex machine. You know, moving and grooving. Turn it off! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven! Now, a skeleton ghost is a hybrid creature, so the AC is much higher than a skeleton or a ghost. Through a window, mouse hole, and chimney you've gone. This spooky night is ending. It's almost dawn. The time has come to say goodbye. You've mastered this game of spooky I spy. Psych! This game will last for five more hours, and when it's done, your soul I'll devour! So, Andy, on the hauntometer. Oh, that's the thing? What 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 do you want to give I Spy Spooky Mansion? For uh, first this? off, I want to thank Miss Billman's kindergarten class. Thank you, Miss Billman. Um, but I'm gonna give it eight stars. Well, I'm gonna give it a very disturbing supercut of a bunch of sexual quotes. Made from a child's game. I can't wait for you to come on my face and come in my mouth. Fill up my mouth with urine. Yum. Shove your finger in my tight little butt. Shove your tongue in my tight little butt and open it wide. And eat out my downstairs. Take out your snake. <laughs> I spy two little nuts and a little penis. Great job. And it boots us back to the desktop. Hooray! Save it to your desktop. Well, this has been I Spy Spooky Mansion. I hope you all out there thought this Let's Play was worth $800. Because guess what? They've been billing us by the hour for this game. <laughs> you thought you were done, but wait and see. There's a sequel for this game on the Nintendo Wii. No! no! You solved all my puzzles, which I knew you could do. When's the Let's Play of Broken Sword 2? No! Hey everyone, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to click on that skull to subscribe, and if you want to see more- Well done! You beat all the puzzles and finished your goals. And Chris went one whole episode without mentioning trolls. You solved all my riddles, which was a big to-do. But Andy? Who do you think will be on the soundtrack for Trolls 2? Welcome to Sex, Drugs, and Rock and Troll, a surprise podcast that speculates the sound-